Hello, hello. Welcome to Conan Exiles. I am the Prowler, and here we are. And we're going to do part two of the Taxidermy Guide. So let's get started. Alright, so. Let's go to the feats. Go check out the second feat for Taxidermy. <coughs> this one's called a Hunter. And as you can see, we have a few different animals. This we got the gazelle head trophy, kudo head trophy, antelope head trophy, crocodile head trophy, and panther head trophy. Okay, so we're going to talk about locations first. Uh, the panther head and the antelope head require us to go away from the noob area. So we'll do them first. Um, Let's look at what we got. Like just like last time, we're gonna need a hatchet. To chop their heads off, <coughs> and we're gonna need a thrall, just uh, in case. This is Tess of the Blade. She's got the Sword of Chrome and the Sobek armor set. All right, Sobek armor set. You get that up here. Zalthar's Refuge. Swords of Chrome. You get them here in the name city from killing stuff certain bosses, the skeleton bosses drop it. Okay, so this is where I am right now, down here. This is my island where I got the base. So for us to get the panther head, we gotta go way over here to the jungle, all right? So we're gonna go there first, but also to get the antelope head, we have to go here. This is a little savanna. There's some lions and elephants and <coughs> antelopes and whatever. Um, as far as the rest of what's hunter taxidermy feet, I'm all here. The gazelles are here, the kudo is here, and the uh, the crocodiles are all around here. Alright, so let's get to it. I got Tess of the Blade following. I got some new armor, fresh new armor. I'm not really carrying anything else. As you can see, I already grabbed some of these heads, but we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead and grab new heads anyways. So let's start off here. We're going to go to get the panther heads in the jungle here. Now this is really easy to get to. And this is the reason why I go here. We're going to use teleports just because uh, we're going to save time for the video, right? We'll warp over here. Hopefully the thrall comes with us. <coughs> Sometimes the thralls do weird stuff. I've lost multiple thralls. That's just kind of part of Conan. So we'll give her a minute here to load in. Oh, there's a crocodile right here. Ooh. All right. We get a crocodile head early. All right. Let's see what this crocodile. Hey, crocodile head. Awesome. So, <coughs> we don't have to do that. Now, I want you to pay attention here. Right? Where we are. Over here. And notice this little river. We're going to need deer later for a later feat. So, I want you to pay attention to that. You can get the deer in other places as well. I, I believe they're up north, too. But, uh, yeah, anyways. We're going to run straight to the spot where panthers are. There's a whole bunch of panthers up here. It should only take you know, a couple kills to get one. So keep on running up here, running up here. Run up these stairs. Don't care about that guy. <coughs> He's like a monkey man. Well, ape man, I guess. Alright. So you follow this little trail. You go over this bridge up over this hill will be some panthers. Thrall's back there still, taking her time. It's okay. Alright, so we got some panthers. Here's a panther. Get us. There we go, now she's interested. Alright, so one dead panther. Oh, we got the panther head right away. We'll let her 
kill this one. Come on, lady. Jeez, sometimes they're so friggin' bad at doing the simplest things. Okay, so I go over to this little safe spot here. She's with us. Okay, so we got the panther head. Awesome. One out of five. Now we'll go over here. This is the little savanna area. And I'm going to go right here. Warp onto this little spot here. Takes a second to load in. Come on. Alright. Here we are. Here's the savanna. Okay. So you can see... Oh. Uh, you can see there's like... Oh, there's some antelope right there. Oh, well, that actually looks like the kudo head guy. Which is okay, too. Right. Oh, well, that kind of sucked. Do I have God Mode on still? <coughs> I think I do. Yep. Enough of that. Alright. Ah, oh, it sucked. Okay, anyways. So you come down here and look, there's a whole bunch of antelopes, right? So we'll get out our axe. Kill an antelope. Ah, oh, dead. Okay, so cut off its head. Hopefully we get an antelope head. I had to kill several of these to get my other one. I hate when they run away, too. Some of the weak animals, they just run away. Oh, here comes the kudo. <coughs> Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay, so let's hit this antelope. No antelope head. Kudo, kudo head right away. Boom, yeah. Alright, let's run around here some more. There are more antelopes. Ah, an elephant. I don't really want to fight an elephant. hit Tessa there so she should get in on the action good 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 no what the heck come on get the aggro are you gonna hit it crap this game is so bad in so many, so many places you know, like this elephant still wants me I haven't even hit it Terrible quality. Such a great game, but just so many bad things. So many bad parts to this game. Oh, still no antelope head. Alright, kill some more antelopes. Stupid brawls. Oh, wait, that sounds like a tiger. Yeah, tiger. If you encounter the tiger here, go ahead and fight it. Because... Come on. Oh, get in there. Jesus. That's so terrible. <laughs> Anyways, if you fight the tiger, go ahead and fight it. Because uh, it has a head, too, for a later one that you can save for later. Right? Kudo head, tiger head. There we go. Yep. Alright, so let's go find more antelope. There's another one over there. This is a fair sized area, so you know, you'll. You can uh, encounter some stuff. While you're here. Come on, give me the head. There we go, antelope head. Alright. 
So that's all the ones you had to travel for, the antelope head and the panther head, and we got both of those. So now I'm going to take us back down to my area, a little home base here, if I can get it. Sometimes it's worth it to zoom in the map a little bit. We'll go back to the home area. <coughs> Now, for the gazelle, that's what we're going for now. We're going for gazelle. Because <coughs> we got the croc head, we got the panther head, we got the kudo head, and we got the antelope head. So, the last video, I went this way for the hyenas. We're going to go the same way again. Cross this river... By here. Where's the crocodile? There's usually a crocodile here. Okay, anyways. We'll run by here. We'll probably attract all the hyenas. Which is okay. Crawl's here. We'll let her get in there. Come on. I'm stuck. Great. Jeez, good job, Conan. Way to make, uh,. You know, way to make a good quality game there. Anyways. Here's an ant. Uh, gazelle. Gazelle time. Ah, yeah. <sighs> no gazelle head. Alright. Gazelle head here. Maybe. As if, like, chopping it would just flip it like that. That's so terrible. Terrible, terrible. It's like nobody playtests the game. It's been out for three years. Nobody's playtested it. <laughs> terrible. Oh, come on, stop. Oh, and we keep hunting for the gazelle head. Thralls take forever to get involved on these, and these things run, so you can't really, like, you know, allow the Thrall to do this. You kind of got to do it yourself. You know, Thralls don't solve all the situations. They're pretty good. They're going to get you around all the game. There's certain things like this that the Thrall just can't help you with. Because of the Thrall mechanics. Oh, still no head. Lovely. Oh, and here comes the sandstorm. Great. That's going to be an interesting video. Watch the sandstorm. So, sandstorm mask. Put it on. Now you don't get hurt. Just like that. It's a little OP for the... Uh, oh. Of time. There we go, gazelle head. Alright, we got all the little heads. Let's uh, run back to the base now. So, yeah, as usual, I got the no eating on in the always noon time. Because, uh, you know, we don't want to have to look at the dark worry about food and water when we're just trying to show you locations and stuff, so. Swim across here. This takes you to the little shaleback island that's right beside my house. So we're going back to the artisan's table. We're going to make us some trophies. And we'll, uh, call it a day. You can hardly see anything in a sandstorm, eh? It's, it's hard to move around. The thrall acts funny. 
It's uh, it's really it's really strange that they can't get anything right. All right, so I'm gonna drop off my thrall here because we don't need her anymore for today. Stay there, Tessa. And now we're gonna go to the artisans bench. All right, so what do we got? Oh, a whole lot of meat. Look at all that. There's always so much junk in these types of games that you loot that you don't ever really need because why do you need it? <coughs> Alright, so what did we need here? We need a gazelle, antelope, kudo, crocodile, and panther. So just like last time, you know, you put them all on the artisan's bench and uh, you go from there. So. Here's antelope head, like that, crocodile head, like that, uh, that's the deer, right, yeah, gazelle head, like that, keep on scrolling, there's the kudo head, like that, and uh, all that's left is the panther head. <clears throat> There's the panther head, and we'll make that. So, here we go. Grab each one of those heads. And then we'll go back to my little display area. Alright. <clears throat> I didn't put up the heads this time so that you guys can see the process of putting the heads up. Put them on the radial wheel. I play on Xbox, so that's why it's like that. Alright. So, there's gazelle head. There's an antelope head. There's a kudo head. And here's a panther head, they're kind of small. And then here's a croc head, nice and big. So we'll go in first person mode here and have a good look at these. Gazelle, antelope, kudo, panther, crocodile. So I know you think that, you know, they look great and all that, and you think, oh, I'm going to be able to put them all nice inside. Well, I'll show you inside what I have so far. And you can see that some of these heads are huge. Right? Look at it. That one's huge. That one's huge. Those are rhino heads. I have the rhino king head outside because he was so huge you couldn't even get him inside my house. <coughs> So you might want to make sure that you build like a huge house or, you know, have multiple spaces for these because uh, there's dragon heads coming and all kinds of stuff. Alright. So there's the heads for this issue. This feet is called a hunter. And you need the apprentice taxidermis feet first. You don't have to make the stuff from the apprentice taxidermis feet. You can just go ahead and make these if you want. You can skip to any of them once you've once you've purchased them from the feet list. But uh, yeah, there they are. And that's it. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a really great day. And uh, enjoy your time in Conan Exiles because it's lots of fun. All right, have a good one. Bye.